What's up, Guru Gang? Welcome to the Inner Sanctum. I'm Yoda Guru. Come on in, sit, stay, relax, put your feet up, grab a couple snacks, have yourself a hot or cold beverage, your choice, your prerogative. My sanctum is your sanctum. And enjoy my reaction to episode number four of DC's Doom Patrol. And the title of this episode is Cold Patrol. I didn't um, read over the synopsis, so what I'm guessing here is, um, just a guess, that um, since the title is Cult Patrol of this episode, um, uh, 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 Cliff ends up uh, joining a cult because he is that gullible, and um, and it, it, it's up to the, the 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 Doom Patrol to get him out of it. So that's what I'm guessing. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong, but that's what I'm guessing. So let's not waste any time and get into the episode itself. Before we do, if you enjoyed my content, whether it be for my Inner Sanctum channel or YG Anime Channel for all things anime. Link is right up there. Check that out. Help support that channel as you're supporting this channel as it's slowly growing. Um, uh, it already has another subscriber, so I tip my hat to you, to uh, to that individual who uh, subscribed. Um, do a fist tap, high five, and celebratory um, uh, Perfect Strangers, Dr. Bartokimos, Coastal Larry Apple, and Dance of Joy. Um, like I said, like I, like I said, if you enjoyed either content for your channel, uh, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and be notified of any future videos <coughs> being posted on your channel. And when it comes to the full length reaction, um, uh, episode, uh, for this, for this episode, um, it'll be, uh, uh posted on Patreon or Rumble. Um, along with my past, other past videos that I've reacted to, um, uh, it's full length, sick up on your rant, and, um, like I said, the uh, full length episodes, Patreon and Rumble, and those two links, along with my social media links, posted underneath this video in the description section. And with that said, let's get into episode number four of Doom Patrol, uh, episode is called Cult Patrol, alright, here we go. 17 years ago, Happy Salt Lake City, Utah. Happy What's going on? Now it's a birthday. Happy birthday to you. There is the light. And the light created a shadow. Hmm. And the shadow was good. When is this the focus cult? finished, all would be clear. <laughs> What's going on? Got the expression on my dad's face. Where's the happy birthday boy? There you are. <laughs> 18th I birthday, alright. <laughs> I forgot the knife. Run. Uh oh. You're not here to save the world, son. You're here to end it. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Day is the day, Elliot. The book is complete. It's your day to save the world. It's oh, going to be no. fantastic. You get down here and you eat this fucking cake, Elliot! Ooh, okay. Hey! It's Crowley from Supernatural. Days, sinking feeling. The cult of the unwritten book was active again. The it cult of the unwritten time. book, okay. So, okay. Bye bye, Spain. Look at those alarm clocks. I set the sparrow with my bow and arrow. Like I said, uh oh, that's not good. I set the fly with my little eye. Who did his grave? I set the crow, for I will bury him. Shit! Only death can grow. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Suck to the book. There's Negative man. High school. Class of forty-six. We're high school sweethearts. <laughs> and when did you meet Staff Sergeant John Bowers? Fuck you. Mm. Doesn't like that uh, uh, interfering in his life. 
there are 37 known dimensions in the universe. Ooh, 37. As you can see, yeah. I've them. <laughs> Our challenge as a team is to pinpoint... Yes. We're not a team. Mm. Where's Rita? I'm right here. I guess my invite got stuck at Western Union. You want to sit this one out, you know? Not being into it and all? But I'm sure we can think of something for you to do if you want. Oh, Victor just pissed her off. <laughs> oh, you, you just, uh, Where the hell are you arrived. <laughs> the counts of the unwritten Made himself so at home. Much. Excuse me, sir. Where the hell is he? We don't know where he is, or for that matter, when he'll be back. But if you'd like to leave a message, maybe tell us who you are. A message? Sure. Dear Calder, you wanker. <laughs> I need my penny, you nicked. Because the world's about to fucking end again. Signed your old <laughs> pal, Kip. That's your name, Kip. Name's Kipling. Willoughby Kipling. Oh, Willoughby Kipling. Nice Templar, in case you're wondering. I'm very big in the world of, shall we say, international strangeness. To go ahead, check me out. In the meantime, I'll be in that bag of gun shit's office. Saving the world. Bring Sam and Neil along with you. So Calder never told any of you freaks about the cult of the unwritten book. Mm. Who of them? What? <laughs> What's the cult of the unwritten book? Goddamn nightmare for starters. The book, which they believe to be the word of God, is being written as we speak. Once it's completed, the cult will attempt to read it. If successful, the eye will be summoned. The decreator. And the world will be unmade. <laughs> Sisters of Our Lady of the Razor paid me a visit this morning. Nuns. Straight razor in each hand. <laughs> Cut through walls. Doesn't take a rocket scientist to know it's a sign. The book is close to being finished. We need to find the book before the cult finds him. Wait, what do you mean, him? <laughs> Book's a person. That makes no sense. Hmm. Where is this book? It's blood on the coin. Baphomet will tell us. Who? Okay. The oracle is a horse or a unicorn. <laughs> is that a spike in his head? In the horse's head? A singing oracle. Okay. <laughs> I say, fuck that limey in the horse head he rode in on. Oh, keep chatting. Take your time. <laughs> it's not as though we're trying to hold the apocalypse or anything. <laughs> we're in. Glad you can fit it in your schedule. <laughs> what is that? What's it look like, my old heads? Oh, oh, oh. It's a door. A portal. Go through it. You'll find the book, Elliot. So you smoke a couple of cancer sticks and suddenly you can open a door to anywhere. Fuck it, let's party. Wait! <laughs> oh, what on earth was that? Two grams of Michelangelo's ashes. You are not well. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear God! <laughs> they call me. It's a cloaking spell. Hides him from the cult. All right. Why is it time to complete the job? Cloaking We're spell. Saving, kid. What else is there? If he gets red, it's Katie Bar the bloody door. Then we stop him from being red. There has to be another way. Yeah, sure. It's easy. All we have to do is close the bloody gates of Nurnheim, and after that, we can cure cancer. <laughs> so we close the gate. How hard could it be? Not a case, not a gate, it's, it's a stigmata on a person on the hands. And as the gates open, more assassins are unleashed. That's not good. Uh, assassins? Yeah, and I don't mean milfs with cleavers, look. <laughs> to close the gates is to find the person with the stigmata and sew the wounds shut. That won't be hard. Not. <laughs> oh, suddenly I'm missing you. Oh, <laughs> dental floss. Dental floss. Dental floss. The strongest known spiritual thread in the world. The only oh. thing powerful enough. Okay. So the gate's shut. Now. With dental floss. <laughs> Don't be idiot. 
gates. Don't fart around. Just close the gates. Where are these gates? This will tell us where. Fuck it all, my last piece. Chewing gum. Chewing gum. <laughs> Knowing gum. Knowing gum. Now give me the answer. Where can we find the gates of Nurnheim? What's it taste like? Mint? Oh, you swallowed it. <laughs> you swallowed it. Mm. Got it. Thank you, Flint. Okay, Hammerhead. Uh, I'll secure the perimeter and make sure everything is locked up tight. I need hot sauce. Check the fridge upstairs. What do you need hot sauce for? You think Larry is different from me? He'll be the first to tell you he's no hero. You can't make us into something we're not, Vic. No hmm. matter how much you have to prove. I'm not here to prove anything. Bullshit. You know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe Larry's not a hero. But that thing inside him is. Hello? Who's in there? Is it that us? Hey, yep, easy. It's whoa, whoa, Padre. We're here to help stitch you up. Me amo Cliff. Cliff. Well, that's all smash I got. <laughs> Hammerhead! Help me close this guy's stupid hand gate things! Right. Let me help you, motherfucker! Whoa, whoa. Just like you held all those people who tried to What is her problem? I trusted you! I don't know what happened to you, but this isn't about that! <laughs> Okay, where are they now? <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, indeed, Cliff. Is this Nurnheim? This isn't snow. Yeah. You really shit the bed on this one, didn't you? That fucknut magician gave us one job to stop the end of the world. But no, you had to kick the gate wide open. I'm sorry, sir. Wait, which one are you? Penny Farthing, sir. Penny, Please don't all right. Me, sir. Uh oh. Where's Hammerhead? Another personality. I'm stuck in Nurnheim, and I don't even get to yell at Hammerhead. I'm sorry, sir. Interloper. Oh. You have no business here. That is technically true. You. All righty then. Penny, you ready to fight? Yes, sir. Seriously. Now. All right. Now I'm James with them, or the personalities with them. Oh. <laughs> it does suck, Cliff. What? Okay. Evolve, evolve, emude. Oh, it's for a spell. Okay. We won. The hot I sauce. <laughs> Lie, saw, la. The threshold, like a rosary, has been enchanted. No salt. No. Uh, <laughs> and one on each door. <laughs> then get through that. Grab the kid. No. Fuck it all. World's meant to end. That incantation. Love me do. Hard day's night is much stronger, but uh, can never remember the words. What's your plan? You zap everything that comes through that door. Zap, yeah, amongst other things. A lot of faith to put in gadgets. Your book's not being hunted by a pack of muggers. I'll take science over whatever it is that you do any day of the week. We're gonna have to re-examine our options. Are you talking about killing the kid? I'm talking about destroying the book. That book has a name. Elliot. Seriously, how the hell did now get being. mixed up with you? The man that I've known since I was six wouldn't even dream of what you're suggesting. Sounds like you and I know two different Niles Calders. Hmm. I've got a man who will make the decisions that have to be made to keep the world spinning. A man who's willing to live with those decisions and forever be haunted by them. They told me I had a destiny. He's pretty much sheltered all his hero. life. Save the world. But this, what if? I tried being a hero once and it destroyed everything I had. You're lucky. Lucky? And you can't live for other people. You have to be true to yourself. The cult's after me. They're gonna take me, they're gonna read me, and we die. But you don't know that. I should have just stayed at home. Let him read me get it over with. And don't say that, Elliot. Try to have a little faith. Faith? Hmm. I just saw my fucking mom slit my dad's throat. Fuck your faith! Ooh. Maybe I should just take care of this on my own and just fucking kill myself. Oh, okay. 
the entity. Oh, is uh, freeing him. How many times do we have to go into my past? Again with a session. If the people I know, oh God, knew have nothing to do with this. This is a result of like this. I don't have time to play games with you. Oh. There you are. Look, I know it's easier for you to come out when he's under duress, but we really must work on that. Now, I have something to show you. Now, I know we've tried to communicate in several ways with limited success, but I have a feeling I've nailed it this time. This device could be the answer. Yeah, you I was trying to communicate with an entity. I only want to help you. Both of you. Very good. Now, how do you sustain yourself in Captain Trainer's body? How do you live in there? Torture. Oh, torture. How's that? Torture. I have many more questions I want to ask you. Yeah. He destroyed it. The entity. No more questions. Elliot. Ooh. Elliot, what the hell do you think you're doing? Aren't you supposed to be downstairs with Larry? Why, so I'd be safe? It's all pointless. Hmm. I'm fighting destiny, and why? My life's destroyed anyways. Well, this is only the second floor. <laughs> you wouldn't kill yourself. Maybe break an arm or a leg. Plus, to be fair... You're not really helping, Rita. You have to die and be burned if you want to really save everyone. Failure. In a way, uh, Rena's, a, Rena's being a hero. Not letting uh, Elliot uh, kill himself. Something that she uh, refuses to see it herself. Maybe the people in this house can't save you. We failed before. But can you at least let us try? Hmm. That's a hero. What a hero would say. <laughs> so, what the hell are you supposed to be? We. Are the Archons, the High Priests of Nurnheim. Wait, I know you. You tried to steal that, the vote from me. That's the mom. All of Nurnheim is ours. Dad's taking a real victory lap. <laughs> His suffering was brief. Because soon the Decreator will rise. All of Nurnheim has gone to retrieve and read the unwritten book. Well, good luck finding him. We put a spell on him. We oh, don't, don't everything. Don't say anything. It's invisible to you. You can't read what you can't see. But you're wrong. We see everything. Oh, that's not good. Uh oh. Get the boy downstairs. It's them. You're with me. Hurry. <laughs> oh, that's not good. They're supposed to protect the lab. The the protection the spell broke. Well, let's put them back together again. Activate sonic cannon. Science. What's that for? Ad verbum, aegis protege. Woohoo! Flaming sword! <laughs> Magic. Nice. Bachelors? Assassins. Pain surgeons. Made out of dead skin and letters that were never sent. Ooh. <laughs> This isn't gonna work. It's fine. It's totally fine. Oh, it's not fine. I don't die. And you won't. We're going to gather all the little disgusting beads and keep you safe while the others fight. Science. Nice magic. What are those? Jesus. Hoodman. It's the royal guard and the hoodman. The robot and the lunatic must have dropped the ball on this one. This is bad. Screw him. We keep fighting. That's bad. Sorry. Sorry for what? Oh! oh that's a betrayal right there. Oh, every man for himself, I guess, for Kipling. It's over. Okay. I have to take care of him. There's too many of them. She's 
being a hero. Okay. A white hoodman. Three of them. Or females. And they've taken Elliot. Grenade. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Nice. Huh. Raising your only kid just so you can sacrifice him to a death cult after killing his dad mm. in front of him? That there is some top shelf bullshit. <laughs> to you, I am a bad mother. To many others, I was a good custodian of the book. It was always happy. No, it's not a perspective. That's a delusion. There is no reality. There is only perception. Oh. The way we see things. Being able to see himself as see no longer a robot. Her doing. Then there's how we see. Oh. Clara, you think I see Jane as my daughter? Stop this, please. Or little sister. First, you should see your true essence. Yeah. Scared and wounded child. Oh, K. Who's K? But soon all will see what will be. Oh, this is all on a globe. Well, this isn't good. Oh no. Okay, what's going on? Oh, it's the eye. That's uh, freaky. Is that the decreator? Oh, hoo -hoo. You're too late. the decreator. And there's Kipling. Maybe I should have done a hard day's night. Hmm. Well, that's not good. Hmm. All right, episode number four, Cold Patrol, and uh, I was wrong. Um, of uh, when it comes to my guess as Cliff being a part or uh, being taken in um, by a cult because he is that gullible. It does involve a cult though, so um, it, it involves a, a, a boy, a young man named Elliot, who from the time he was born uh, to his uh, 11th, 12th, uh, 18th birthday, um, and in a uh, celebration of sorts, uh, his parents all through those uh, birthday celebrations up until his 18th um, were happy. And, um, and, the, and, the, and the child has been told that he is um, destined for something greater. And, um, when, and then when, it, when, when his father tried to warn him when his mother went out of the room to run and escape, um, his wife just basically comes up right behind her husband and just slits his throat therefore killing him so um and because of that uh, her son uh, her son is scared runs up the uh, to his room and his mom is pissed off so um that's a cult uh, that part of and uh and the Doom patrol um encounters um uh kipling um uh, played by mark shepherd of um doctor who and uh and uh, supernatural, so um, they don't trust him at first because uh, he just walks into uh, the, the Du Patrol Manor like he owns the place and starts uh, um, ordering things, ordering, ordering people around in a sense. But um, and even though they don't trust him, and despite uh, his connection with um, with uh, Niles Calder, he. Um, uh, tries to uh, ingratiate themselves to the Doom Patrol and gives them as much information as he can, all the while all the while being a little bit mysterious. And during their during their um, introduction, he um, introduces them to the Oracle, a horse with a spike on its head. So um, ultimately, they um, they end up rescuing Elliot. Um, and through by means of uh, via um, Kipling and uh, his weird ways, his mysteriously weird, weird ways, and, um, and 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 moving on, moving on in the storyline, you see that um, uh, during uh, the, the the time of just um, keeping 
um, Elliot's safe, uh, Larry finds out that, um, uh, that, that, uh, Niles uh, was in contact with the entity that's embodied, you know, with his, uh, that's, 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 uh, fused with his body. And the one word that he uh, focuses on is, um, is torture. So, uh, he, he can interpret that in so many ways that he is, in there torturing himself, torturing metaphorically, tor torturing physically, mentally, so many interpretations of that. And, um, and, then, and then we see in the episode that ultimately um, they get, uh, they get um, Elliot, um, the queen, and, um, and sitting right there, as apparently it was a, they already ascended into the north, uh, uh, into their, uh, uh, alternate plane um, uh, in that uh, what looked like snow and Nordenheim um, and uh, those uh, hooded uh, white witches um, were able to uh, read the words on um, the spell or the the book that that is considered Elliot and open and and that released the uh, uh, to bring forth um, that eye that appeared up by the sky, so things are not looking good at all. Um, as uh, the Doom Patrol is facing uh, a big threat uh, now, now uh, as they are um, uh, joined by Kipling. So, um, looking forward to reacting to episode number um, number five and um, see how this uh, plays out and how it ends. So. I uh, hope you enjoyed my reaction to episode number four, Cult Patrol. Um, if you enjoyed either, either content uh, when for either channel when it comes to um, either my YG Anime channel for all things anime, it is right up there. Check that out. Help support this channel. And as you're supporting my Inner Sanctum channel, and especially this episode when it comes to Doom Patrol. And um, the full-length reaction of this episode will be posted either on my Patreon and or Rumble. And uh, like a full-length, uh, full you can stick up on your end. And the uh, full-length reactions, along with my past reactions, posted in the Patreon and Rumble. Both links along with my social media links posted underneath this video in the description section. And um, with that said, um, much, much appreciated again for the support. Um, hopefully we can keep this going and uh, uh, help build up this channel. It's up to you guys. In any case, like I said, I'm looking forward to episode number five of Doom Patrol. And um, tip my hat to you. May the force be with you. And um, uh, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and uh, hit that notification bell and be notified of any future videos uh, being posted on either channel, all right? Uh, or on this, this channel. So, um, with that said, tip back to you, and uh, may the force be with you. Alright, later.